What's up guys, Dope Gamer here, and today I'm going to give you a tutorial on how to get Maroon's Razor. First, let me say that you must be level 20 to get the invitation to the Dawnstar Museum. Now, I already have the invitation, but since I'm already in his house, it took it out of my inventory. First thing that you want to do is come to Dawnstar, and it is on the top middle of the map. As you can see, top middle. And I would say that it is in between Solitude and Winterhold and the College of Winterhold. So you have to come to Dawnstar. The house that you are looking for is Silas Vesius's house. And when you spawn into Dawnstar, you want to go straight on the path in front of you. And when you get down to the tree section, you want to take a right. And his house is the last house on the right. The next thing you want to do is start a conversation with Silas. And he will tell you about Maroon's Razor. And he will tell you a little story along with it. While in the dialogue, you will also want to... Acquire the mission on getting all three pieces of Maroon's Razor. As you can see, I do not have these dialogue options because I've already talked to him about it. Silas tells you that there are only three pieces to the Razor, but there are actually four. As you can see, when I exit out of the dialogue and walk over to the case on the right, there is the sheath part of the razor inside the case. Now let's get into this tutorial and I will see you in the next part. Alright guys, so the next thing we're going to want to do is come to Mark Arth and Mark Arth is to all the way to the left on the map and then it is by Falkreath in between Falkreath and Solitude all the way to the left of the map okay and then what you're gonna wanna do is come to Dead Crane Rock which is the same place as Hag Rock Redoubt so you're going to want to, I suggest you go to left hand mine like I did because I have a 3000 bounty in here. And I went to left hand mine and there's, you will walk forward across the bridge and then there will be a trail to your right. You walk that to a certain, to the next bridge and then you can run up the hill onto Hag Rock Redoubt and Dead Crane Rock. Now, as you see, there will be a large amount of Forsworn. Probably not now, but I died earlier. Hold on, one second. Right there. There we go. So, I'm just going to go around these Forsworn and just enter in right here. Hagarok Redoubt Ruin. So, you just want to go in here. Alright guys, so the next thing you're going to want to do is go through that little tunnel, or that, uh, the red, red rock or doubt ruins or whatever it's called, and it'll take you to about down there, and then there will be two, there will be two enemies there, it will be a force one Briarheart and a spider, as you can see, a giant frostbite spider, and then you'll come up to Dead Crane Rock. And what you're going to want to do is enter through this door. Alright guys, so the next thing that you're going to want to do is clear that out. And 
it still still wants me to go down there because the uh, other other three people. Oh shit! What the hell? Oh, you, aren't you aren't you amazing? So you're gonna want to take this bitch out. Sorry, no time for explanation. Oh, she's recharging. Oh, don't you even do that. Okay, so you're gonna want to take her out first of all and as you can see she has the part so you're gonna want the pommel stone of Mirun's razor so take that and then anything else you want and I'll see you in the next part so guys the next thing you want to do is come to Morthal and I'll show you where that is on the map Morthal is in the left well, how about we say western middle of the map, and this is also in between Solitude and Dawnstar, as you can see, Morthal, right there, so yeah, I'm going to come in here, and you're going to want to head down here to this guy right here with the arrow Mostly over his head, Jorgen, and you're going to talk to him about to the razor. Don't know what you're talking about, stranger. I have heard of him. My father had suspicions about his connection to the mythic dawn. Guess they were true. I don't need this. My family wasted eight generations keeping that razor safe from a dead colt. As far as I care, it can stay locked in my house. I don't care, but my ancestors do. You can't have it. This looks like I'm going to have to... Uh... Actually, I don't want to pay, so how about we brawl? You want to fight? You got it. There, let's go. God might get nervous. I am a Khajiit, so I do more damage when unarmed. Oh, that's, that's, that's a day when you see guards aching on a fight. Damn it. Why don't you have to walk into Morthal? Come on, let's go back to the ground. Come on! So... in the chest inside my house. Great. So I'll see you when I get to his house. So after he gives you the key, you're going to want to come to Jorgen and Nami's house, which is just down the road. And you're going to want to come to this chest right here, Jorgen's chest. And you're going to want to open it and take the hilt of Mayrun's razor and the other goods inside it if you want. And I'll see you in the next part. So guys, the next thing you're going to want to do is head to Cracked Tusk Keep, which is by Falkreath. Now Falkreath is on the southern middle part of the map. As you can see, Falkreath is all the way down here. And Falkreath is in the middle of Riften and Morthal. In between the middle and just below of Whiterun and Riverwood and Helgen and all those other fun places. So what you're going to want to do is fast travel to Falkreath and then walk all the way over to, if I can get it, Crack Tusk Keep. Okay. So now what you're going to want to do is you're probably going to have to clear out. Nope. Okay then. We'll just walk right in. So you're going to want to enter Crack Tusk Keep. So you're going to want to go through that, and then you're going to want to clear out, I believe, three enemies. And then as you can see, this orc right in front of me has the piece of the dagger we need to find. So I'm just going to show you fighting this guy. Show you me fighting this guy, and hopefully we can get this piece off him. I want the first. Oh, come at me. Oh, don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move. Okay, I can tell this guy's going to be a hard one. Um, as you can see, I'm only level 20. I just started. Um, yeah, I'm not really doing too well in this game so far. So I'm just, I'm just going to watch my health.
stay up far away as in from him as possible. Oh god. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, down your spinal cord. Oh yeah. So, you're gonna wanna loot this guy. You're gonna take the key, take his gold, take all his armor if you want. Okay. Oh, so. Now you're gonna want to go down here. You just needed to loot the key off him. You want to go down here. Okay, yeah. Activate this button. Undo this chain. Or whatever that was. And you're going to want to enter Crack Tusk Vaults. So the next thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to hit this lever. And then you're going to want to hit this lever to bring down these guards right here. And then there'll be four trip wires. I stepped in this one, but they all shoot arrows ahead of you. So as long as you stay at least this far away from it, you'll never get hit by it. So there's going to be four trip wires, and I'm not sure what those are going to do as of now. But as you can see, we can now get the shards of Mayroon's razor. So you're going to want to take these. Oh, yep, arrows. On the top, see. And then you're gonna wanna bring all the blades back to Silas. So, guys, the next thing that you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna come back to Dawnstar, come back to Silas's house, and you're gonna wanna give him these pieces. My family were in the Mythic Dawn. All at once. You're efficient. Oh, I like that. Get a nice 2,400 gold. Finally, all the pieces of Mehrun's razor are in my hands. It's time I let you in on something. There's a fourth piece, that scabbard in the display case, built to house the razor. And there's more. I know how to put all the pieces together. We just need to take them to Dagon's shrine and contact the Lord of Change directly. Ever since I was a boy, I've... Don't you see? So I'm going to skip this to just to make this video as short as possible. For your guys' enjoyment as well as mine. Now see you when we get to the next part. So the next part you're going to want to do is you're going to want to come to Shrine of Mehrunes Dagon. And this is right by Dawnstar. It's just south of Dawnstar. And it's in the middle of Morthal and the Winterhold and College of Winterhold. And the next thing you're going to want to do is talk to Mehrunes Dagon, and he's going to tell you to kill Silas. And if you want this razor, that is exactly what you have to do. So the next thing you're going to want to do is kill Silas, and then talk to Mehrunes Dagon again. Tell him thank you for the razor. And he's going to tell you this. Place your hands on my altar one last time, and you will witness the power of Mehrun's day God for yourself. And it will build all the pieces of the eraser. And now you have Mehrun's eraser. So you can take it, and the last thing he'll say to you is he'll give you a challenge and you have to fight uh, three or four Dramora or Daedric people and you can use Mehrun's Razor to do it. So one last challenge and you can test how good this is. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial on how to get Mehrun's Razor and I hope you enjoyed this video and have Happy and safe travels, and I will see you in the next video.